The following interview was conducted with Melissa Jesse for the Purdue University Oral History Project. It took place on August 4th, 2017 at the Indiana State Fair. The interviewer is Adriana Harmeyer. So Melissa, could you tell me briefly when you were at Purdue and what you studied there? I was at Purdue from 1994 to 1998, and I studied at Cranert, and I am an accountant. Fantastic. Do you remember the first time you went to Purdue? I'm sure it was for a high school visit um, at some point, but I don't remember a ton about it other than lots of brick buildings. <laughs> Are you from that area? My parents live right outside of Lafayette, so yeah. When you think about your time at Purdue, of course you think about classes and studying. What places on campus did you go to study? The Union, probably the most. Um, the undergrad library, and probably the basement of Craner. Mm -hmm. The old Craner, I guess. <laughs> Where did you like to spend your, your time on campus when you weren't studying? Anywhere outside, as long you know, if the weather was good, um, and the camp, I loved the campus, so it was just great to find a spot and just hang out. Mm -hmm. Did you have a job while you were a student? I did. It was off campus. Okay. Mm -hmm. What did you do? Um, I worked for a used car dealership in town. So, did you have other family members attend Purdue? No. You were the first in your family? I was the first in my family, yeah. Have you visited campus recently? Yeah, yeah, we were there for the spring football game, I think. Is there a spring football game? Is there a scr spring scrimmage or something? Yes, there was a spring football game. Like something? It was when the, yeah, like the new football coach had just kind of started and all that, so yeah. Okay. <laughs> Did you take time to wander around campus a little we bit? We did some. Um, we spent more time over, and we went to a game at Mackey too this year. So we spent more time over that direction mm -hmm. just because that's where, you know, the football stadium and the basketball stadium are right there. So we spent more time over there, and mm -hmm. it's changed immensely from when I was there. What <laughs> There's a grocery store over there. That's so cool. <laughs> what do you think is the biggest change? Is it the growth? The growth, and I think just... Um, acclimating to what the students need and or want um, because it's just different now. Mm -hmm. um, they want things closer. They maybe don't all have a car. I think more people had a car when I was on campus. Um, I don't know. It just constantly evolves, but it's done so in a tasteful manner, I would say. Mm -hmm. What do you think has stayed the same about Purdue since you were a student? Anything? It still feels the same when you go to campus. I mean, everything has to change or it would be really boring world. So it still feels the same. Like you still walk into Ross Aid and it's still an exciting place to be, but it's different than when I was there because they've added on and they've done different things. Um, but it's still, you know, it's still a football game. And the same with Mackey, like Mackey's completely different. You can have food in Mackey Arena now. You could not have food when I was there, <laughs> which my husband never understood. <laughs> He's like, what? I'm like, I'm sorry, it's the rule. <laughs> so I, you know, I mean, those things were necessary, but it's just weird to someone when, because when I was there, you couldn't do that. So, but it still feels the same when you're there, even though something's different. Mm -hmm. Do you have any favorite memories that stand out? Some of my closest friends I met in college. I just saw one a couple weeks ago. We only see each other about once a year. We get our kids together, we meet up somewhere. Um, we don't even talk all the time, but we pick up right where we left off. So it's exciting to just, mm -hmm. you know, I have a couple of friends like that I saw in July where it's like we didn't miss a beat and everything was exactly where we left it the last time, so. It's fantastic. Yeah. Do you think there's anything about Purdue that doesn't get talked about enough? Something that should be highlighted more than it is? I don't know. That's a great question. Um, I, I think a lot of people, like, I think a lot of people my age probably somewhat took it for granted um, because I think 
Well, from my perspective, when I got out of college, I was an accountant from Purdue, and people were like, Purdue has accountants because we're so known for engineering. But now that's changed, and there's a shift, and people are like, oh, wow, the Crane Art School's awesome. So I think that there's a lot of marketing being done to make people aware of that. And, um, you know, I would love for my boys to go to school. <laughs> I don't know. So, yeah, that's probably all. That's great. Do you have any advice for incoming students? Enjoy it. It goes so fast. I mean, do what you're there to do, obviously, and get your degree and work hard at that, but enjoy all of that as well, everything that it has to offer. Take it all in. Do you have any last comments or, or thoughts, memories you'd like to share? No, I don't think so. Okay. Well, thank you. You're welcome.